Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Just Kick the Dancing Avon Lady, and today we have a first of a kind on this channel. <laughs> Today, we are introducing a brand new collection called Sophie. This is a 100% organic cotton cover pad for your menstrual cycle. And what this is, is that it is a product that is chlorine free, fragrance free, so it is less irritating for your intimate parts. I have never heard of this brand. I have went on their website and just kind of like sneaked through all of their videos just to try to figure out the proper pronunciation of it. Because I was like, is it Sophie? Because it's really soft or is it Sophie, like the name? So it's Sophie and there's three different kinds. So this one here is the overnight, which will probably be the longest one. And this is the regular one for your regular use. And then here is the panty liner. And the quantities do change uh, according to the type. So the panty liner ones, this is a pack of 40. The regular ones is a pack of 20. And the overnight ones is a pack of 10. So I think ideally this would last like... For me, it'll probably last like two cycles, to be honest with you, at least two cycles, which isn't too bad. And <laughs> when I heard about this, I was like, ooh, I'm actually kind of excited to get my period this time around, or as I always call it, Tom, my time of month, which is very rare because I'm not one to go, woohoo, I have my Tom. It's not the most fun thing to go through every 30 to 40-ish days. So why this product is exciting and why I was really interested in it was because of the fact that it is made from 100% organic cotton. And so it is internationally accredited by the OSC, which stands for the Organic Cotton Standards. So it is certified organic. Uh, the other thing that about this is that the cotton used it has been grown without the use of agricultural chemicals, such as pesticides or fertilizers for more than three years. So this isn't, this isn't like a first year or a second year. This is a third year organic baby minimum. So I am on my period now. And so I'm going to be testing this out for you. Uh, I'm going to open up all of them to show you the different sizes as well as compare them to the sizes of the brand that I'm not going to name that I normally use just to kind of like see the difference, right? So I was doing a little bit of research as to why it's important to use organic cotton pads as opposed to your standard pads. Um, so in addition that these ones are really flexible, they are thinner, they also, um, if they're free of dyes, free of fragrances, so there's definitely a lot less irritants in this particular brand of menstrual pads. The fact is that you want to irritate your intimate areas as little as possible. Trust me on this. Because an irritated area is not a, God, I'm gonna say happy area. This is weird. Full disclaimer, this video might be full of TMIs. Just so you guys know, be warned. If you don't like TMI story, go to check out one of my other videos, such as this one. I'm just giving you fair warning. Especially in the summer when it's hot. It gets hotter when you're on your period because you're wearing basically a diaper all day and it's uncomfortable and you don't always want to wear a tampon. And so therefore when you wear pads, it's it can be quite irritating and sometimes just not comfortable chafing and hot and just not a lovely experience. So if you find me cranky, sometimes it might be that, but hopefully this will change that from now on. The thing about the organic cotton versus the traditional is from what I understand, according to research, for your health overall, it's a personal choice of whether you want to use traditional pads, whether they use whatever materials they use, including like plastics, blah, 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 or, or if you want to go with something organic. It is a personal choice, but from an environmental standpoint, it's actually really interesting. A regular pad will take approximately 500 to 800 years for it to decompose. I never even thought of that ever, like the environmental factor of pads and panty liners because they tell me to throw it into my green bin. For those of you who don't know what a green bin is, it's basically the compost bin that our municipality has so that you can throw like, your kitchen scraps in there. We separate our garbage for recycling garbage and kitchen scraps. So I never thought of that because I was just like, oh yeah, it's going to end up in the green bin. It'll be fine. But no, it takes about 500 to 800 years to decompose, which was like 
like mind blowing for me. Whereas the uh, organic tampon will take, well, these aren't tampons, but organic tampons, let's say those take around six months. So that is a huge difference. I'm going to first show you all of the ones that we have and then compare them with the ones that I normally use. The first up for grabs is this one here, which is the panty liner. It is 6.1 inches long. Is it perforated? Uh, yes, perfect. It is perforated at the top here to make it for easy opening access. So I'm just going to pop that baby open. And there's an expiry date on this. What are the expiry dates on all pads? I've actually never even paid attention to that. Imagine if I have been using expired pads all my life. Here it is. No smell. The panty liner. Oh, okay. So they are individually wrapped, which is handy, right? I can just put this into my purse. And so there's a little tabby here. Open it up. Oh, it has little daisy prints on it. Nice. This just feels very thin. So this is the panty liner. Here is one of the brands that I use. So if you take a look at the size difference, it looks like it's gonna be wider and the length is about the same. It definitely is a little bit wider, yeah. So less spillage on the side edge. Next we have, and yes, I'm going to do a fit test. Definitely not showing you any of that, but I'm going to try it on to let you know how it feels while I chase around my son all day. Here is the regular pack. So this is a pack of 20. These are really actually really easy to open. Again, just very simple packaging. It's, it feels very pliable, very soft. Sealed here. Open it up. Oh, okay. This is what the inside looks like. It's kind of raised. It almost looks like it has like a bit of a ditch here. <laughs> Maybe to help with absorption? I don't know. I don't know that much about pads. I just know I use them every month, except for when I'm pregnant. But it's very, it feels quite soft. It's quite thin, so I'm, I'm, I'm very interested to see how it absorbs. I mean, by all means, I normally use quite like the thin pads, but because it is just 100% organic, just cotton, I'm curious. So this is supposed to be more breathable too. So hopefully I'll feel less hot. I do need to run outside for a bit today. We're gonna go for a walk and all those things. So it'll be interesting to test that out. We'll compare it to my other usual one, which is more flashy. This one is the one I normally use. So you can see that size-wise, it looks bigger for sure. So it is going to have more actual physical coverage if that is what you're looking for. But this one feels less flexible. This one feels like, like a little bit has a little bit more like harder structure to it. So it might not mold against your body as well. Whereas the Sophie one does feel a little bit more pliable. The regular one here is 9.8 inches long. Now for the big one. Literally the big one. This one here is the 100% overnight pad. And this one is 12.9 inches long, which is good because I do like them longer at night because I do move and roll around and I am lying down. So I do want to make sure that I have enough insurance on the ends. So this one would be probably like the most expensive one if you want, if you're thinking about budgetary uh, from a budgetary standpoint, because there are definitely less in here. Wow, it is big. It is big like let's open this beauty up it's very minimalistic like the packaging super minimalistic and what I like about it is that when you open it it automatically takes the peel off of the wings for you so these are all wing liners oh oh it even even on the bot back here there's actually an extra like the back here so where you're for your butt part it actually has extra little little stickies so I can stick to your underwear there too. Interesting, very nice. Aw, uh, and this one even gives you like little hearts. Look how long that is, wow. And uh, the front part is pretty much the same as the other of the, as the other part. Very pliable, like super pliable, which is, should, should make it more comfortable. Now let's compare it to my other regular one. This one I have to open, I have to peel, peel, which is fine, it's not a big deal. But this one here, I mean, they, overall, these work fine, but sometimes I feel like they kind of stick to my butt. <laughs> yeah, and it, it does feel plasticky. Like, you can feel it just feels kind of plasticky. But it, it's done its job for the however many years I've been using this particular one. And uh, if you compare it side by side, you can see that it is almost the same size. It's a little bit longer. 
like this part here is a little bit longer and width wise width wise it looks about the same and that's that all right i'm going to try this out i'll probably try the regular one because it's just daytime right now and then tonight i'll use the overnight one and see where that goes all right now it's time to try it on i am pleasantly surprised i just put on one of the regular ones you know how when you put on a pad or you might not know but you know how you put on a pad i'm just going to speak to the people who know right now but if people who don't know just kind of give me a heads up sometimes what you feel is like you put it on and you can you can definitely feel its presence it reminds you that it's there unless you're wearing a tampon but again i don't always wear tampons so i put this on pulled up my panties and my pants and then i proceeded to walk right there i felt a difference so if it, it, it molded to the curvature of my body pleasantly well more so than i've ever felt in a pad before and i actually went oh i am pleasantly surprised okay so fit wise it feels great it's really soft like it doesn't feel crunchy down there like you know like just you know sometimes you get that plasticky feeling you don't feel that and I don't hear it. All right, so far, so good, so impressed. So we're going to wear this for the next few hours and then I'll be back. Yeah, it feels really good. Make me sit on it. I just, I just hope that it's like super absorbent and I hope that it doesn't cause any irritations because I get irritation. And I never thought it was a pat. Hmm. All right, well, let's get on with the day. I am walking. It feels good. Like, it doesn't feel like I have to do like a slight waddle that I'm trying to hide. Hey, my boy. Yeah, it feels really good so far, guys. Hey, it's been several hours later and honestly, I forgot that I was even wearing a pad for most of the day. Um, it's absorbent enough. It's equally absorbent as the other ones that I've been using. It's comfortable. So yeah. I'm very happy with it. Okay. Uh, the, the biggest thing is that I've noticed that it's it doesn't feel as hot and sweaty down there. So it's definitely a lot more breathable, which is really nice. And I think that will definitely be a huge game changer, especially in the summer months. It, oh, the other thing is that it didn't like, you know, sometimes past they kind of shift the stickies. They shift, they're not quite sticky enough and they shift around. Yeah, this pretty much stayed, stayed, um, this one pretty much stayed where I placed it. There was like a, maybe a little bit of shifting, but nothing like normal. And I, you know, I've cooked, I've cleaned, I've ran around after the kids. So overall, I'm quite happy with it. I mean, I can feel it a little bit now because it's been, you know, a few hours and I'm due for a change. So like I said, this video is full of TMIs. We are that much closer now. Overall, I think that I would definitely recommend this if you want to use a product that's like more environmentally friendly and it's something that's chlorine free fragrance free and um also organic is something that's important to you then definitely give this one a try give this one a go it's very comfortable wear like i say i i forgot about it for a good portion of the day i even went out on a walk with the kids it was fine it's like 30 degrees out today so it was very comfortable good morning it is now the next day so i have now tried all three of the sophie pads after trying out the regular pad, I did move on with the panty liner, and oh my gosh, I am slightly in love with the panty liner. It is so soft, and you don't even feel it there. It's just comfortable. Like, <laughs> comfortable. That's it. Like, I did not even notice it was there, to be honest with you. And then overnight, I did try the overnight pads, and it was fine, absorbent enough, and it doesn't look like it shifted at all in my underwear, so all really great things. I would definitely recommend this product if you are someone who's looking for a secure menstrual pad that has little to no shift and um, if organic cotton is something that is important to you for your monthly needs or however you however often you get your period guys um, or even if you're looking for a daily panty liner it's comfortable breathable and i like the fact that the pad the especially the overnight one it i did notice at the beginning it actually has a little tab at the very back to help tear it off in the morning too so that um 
yeah, it just it looked really, really user friendly. The other thing I liked is the wings. They're a little bit smaller than the wings that uh, on the pads that I was using with the, and so that makes actually hugging the curvature of your underwear a lot easier because sometimes the wings they could be a little bit too big and then there's a crinkle and if you don't line it up perfectly, it's just it's a it can be an eventual mess. Let's just say that, yeah. So guys, if you are interested in trying out this product, the Sophie 100% organic cotton pads, whether it be in the panty liner, the regular, or the original, make sure you do click the link in the description box below. And uh, while you're there, go check out that Join Avon button. If you guys are new to this channel, hit that subscribe button as well as a little bell icon beside it so you never miss a video notification. I love you guys. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.